Sims, they compete, but most will meet defeat Cause only one will win The Elimination Challenge mm. Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of The Elimination Challenge Season 7 I'm super excited to get back into this We are down to the final 10 guys And actually we are going to be down to the final 9 very soon As you guys know, Avery, this guy right here Who's looking very excited that he uh, won the challenge And then also Ace Blackjack did win immunity in the last round So any one of the other 8 sims can be eliminated this episode we are going to be focusing on these two guys for a bit and then we will be oh does he want to do sit-ups okay let's do some sit-ups let's do some sit-ups buddy um yeah and then we are going to be getting to that elimination shelly tharp my favorite one of my favorite sims in the last part was eliminated but you know what though it's getting down to the wire and anybody can go at this point so who knows what's gonna happen but yes uh so let's take a look and see oh who's is this shelly who is this? Oh, I missed the phone call. I think it probably was Shelly, though. All right, so Avery is feeling uncomfortable. Why does he have dirty clothing? I don't understand. Why? We've been washing the clothing like mad. Oh, he wants to talk to Steph. Ooh, be funny with Stephanie. I didn't even know these two were close. Hold on, let's take a look at Stephanie's friend meter. Okay, let's see who... Oh, yeah, they're actually not that close, but maybe Avery is start trying to thinking about the end game and how he needs to get some jury votes if he's in the end, and he needs to work on Steph. So let's go ahead and be funny with Stephanie then, since she's right here. Okay, so we're going to go and say more choices, funny, and we're going to do an impression. And actually, if I remember correctly, Avery is a goofball, so hopefully this will bring him some joy you know, and Ace Blackjack is actually feeling super energized. It's like Douglas 2.0. So um, he wants to do a cannonball. Okay, so we'll go do a cannonball. See, I feel like this guy is going to be very, very, very much a loner, even all through his whims. And these two are talking again. Look at Janae and Douglas. Potential final two, man. I mean, I think they're getting along really, really well, which is exciting, you know. So... And then Ace Blackjack's coming over and do a cannonball. So it'll be interesting to see what happens with these guys. And now they're being funny with each other. Okay, so does he want to... So he's going to keep talking to Steph. And I think that's good. You know, like, again, he wants to make some friends. Now he's just tense. Okay, he wants to cannonball into the pool too. Oh, he wants to do something else with Steph. What else does he want to do? He wants to be friendly with Steph. That's cool. I love it. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, be friendly. Okay, we're going to actually ask about her day. You know, we'll ask about her day. And then we'll go ahead and do a cannonball into the pool. Interesting. I, I don't know why Avery's being so friendly with Stephanie. Maybe maybe he feels like she might be on her way out and he needs to really solidify a jury vote or maybe he's thinking of flipping the game you know and working with stephanie and getting to the end maybe i don't know interesting strategy so this guy he's done his backflip now he wants to send an energized text who would you send an energized text to though like honestly who who like um oh maybe shelly because now she's in the jury house you know, might as well try to get some jury votes for Ace Blackjack, too. He's a smarty pants, isn't he? He's just too smart. Well, I'm hoping... Oh, he wants to talk to Macy now. Play ping pong with Macy? Go for it, dude. Oh, Ace, I'm feeling pumped. Let's hit the gym. <laughs> oh, Shelly, I wish. I wish we could, but we can't. Okay, I'm sorry. But yeah, let's play ping pong. Well, I... Well, she's playing basketball. Oh, no, no. She's coming now. She's coming. She's like, yeah, okay. I'll play ping pong. All right. And then Avery is now in the pool. Is he? Fe so he's feeling a little bit better. He's talking to Steph again. Holy shoot. He is really, really friendly with Stephanie this episode. What is going on? I think that maybe that Stephanie and Zoya have come back. It's all about trying to get the original the Sims back together. That's very interesting. Janae's like listening in. She's like, oh shoot, what's happening here? But yeah, like that's that's interesting that these two have come back and now all of a sudden Avery wants to talk to them a lot. Oh, it's getting late. It's already nine o'clock. Oh my goodness. 
Okay, let's go. He wants to make a friend. Well, see, that's a tough one because then I feel like I'm really manipulating the situation. Hopefully, you just talk to Steph enough to you make a friend. Okay, let's go to this guy. Okay, so he wants to uh, hip bump someone. I think I'm going to send everybody to bed now. It's getting kind of late. And then what we'll do is we'll pick everything up in the morning. Um, okay, so yeah, I'm going to have them all go to sleep. Oh, actually, he's pretty hungry. Maybe you... Oh, he's talking to Raina now. <laughs> okay, I'll let them finish their conversation and then Macy's just uncomfortable so you can go get some food and then you can go to bed and then Raina is feeling like after oh she wants to talk to Steph too wow the originals are really starting to like get together I can't control Raina yet but I will I will very soon all right and then she wants to share ideas and finish a painting Okay, so Jayun, oh, Jayun's pretty hungry. You need to go eat. All right, and then he is, yeah, we'll have him go to bed because he'll never sleep otherwise. Oh, no, back float. No, that's not what I want, buddy. Okay, home, where is his bed? I feel like, uh, okay, so he, he can sleep here. Landon is the first one to get up and he is feeling a flirty. Oh, yeah, I mean, it does have to do a lot probably with the romantic room, but still. Um, he wants to take a cold shower. He's like, I'm not flirting with everybody here. You know what I'm saying? He also wants to level up the cooking skill. But I can't use Landon. He doesn't have immunity. So I just have to watch what he does because I don't know what he's going to do. Oh, he's going he's gonna to eat some food that was left out on the table. That's real charming. That's real charming. Okay, so Macy's also awake and she's pretty uncomfortable. She's not eating a balanced diet. Go figure. Um, and then she's also pretty hungry. So yeah, go ahead and eat Macy. We have Zoya who's awake as well. And she's, um, she was going to cook too. So she's going to have a quick meal. Okay, go for it, girl. Go for it. Have a quick meal. Have a quickie. All right. Oh, Stephanie's feeling flirty. Oh, now she's just playing basketball. Oh, but she's still flirty. She wants to woohoo in the hot tub apparently. Oh, is she getting sick? Oh, Raina, Raina, let me get your medicine out. Let's get that over to Stephanie ASAP. Oh, oh, Stephanie has just literally decided that she's not gonna, um, hang on, let me, let me just take the medicine. I'll get her to take the medicine so that you don't, I know you're not sick yet, but you look like you're gonna get sick, so. Perfect, so now you feel better. Beautiful. Why do all my Sims get sick so much, like, so much, like, seriously? All right, so he's feeling great. He has a nice decor. He wants to call someone on the phone. Shelly Tharp. Shelly Tharp, let's call her. All right, let's go uh, chat. Because, again, jury. It's all about that jury vote, man. Gotta start. Oh, he's having an unbalanced meals thing, too. Macy, you're rubbing off on everybody. All right, you stop with your unbalanced meals. What? Uh, oh, shoot. That didn't go very well. <laughs> that did not go very well. She was very upset about that. Okay, Avery is awake, and he is feeling flirty. He wants to woohoo with some... Oh, no. Now he's tense again. Um, yeah. Uh, Macy said hey, but I don't... Wait, does he want to talk to someone? He wants to tell a joke. Okay, let's go ahead and tell a joke to Macy. Okay, let's do... Uh, tell a joke about aliens, yo. Looks like he's talking about slipping on a banana peel. Oh, and now he wants to talk to Stephanie again. Holy moly, Stephanie is like... Her social game was always really good, guys, if you remember from last time. It was always really good. But it's really interesting how, since she's come back, everybody wants to talk to her. I wonder what that's about. Seriously, I wonder what Stephanie's got going on that's making everybody want to talk to her. Okay, and then... We Ace just woke up. He's feeling tense. He needs a bath. Oh, uh, he wants a mud bath. Okay. No, I don't want to do the mud bath idea. Shout forbidden words. Okay. Okay. Let's just do that real quick. Hold on. Let's just do that. Uh, shout forbidden words. Okay. There we go. Make you feel him a little better. Uh oh. He's gonna do it right where sh Jayun's sleeping. Oh, good. She slept right through it. Okay, so it's good. <laughs> she didn't have to hear that, which is great. Oh, Landon's really. Un oh, it's that unbalanced meals, man. I tell ya. It's all about that health. Okay, go talk to Stephanie Avery. What are you doing? What are you doing? There we go. Thank you. Oh, he's cloud gazing by himself. Now Stephanie comes over. All right. So let's talk about the game. How about final two? 
I don't know. How about you? Okay, okay. All right. So, and then let's see. Raina still obviously has that whim. So, what is Stephanie? She's like just, she's just playing it all out. So she's very close with Shelly. Romeo, she's super close with. Um, yeah, there's a lot of opportunity, but. Stephanie being out of the game and coming back definitely presents an interesting dynamic to everything that's going on. So I am curious as to why. Oh, he's feeling flirty again. He wants to tell a dirty joke. Okay. Now, because of the fact that the comments I've seen Macy's name come up quite a bit when it comes to flirting with Avery, I am going to have him tell a dirty joke to... Oh, wait, 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 to Macy. Okay, we're going to have them tell a dirty joke. Okay, how do I, how do, I do this? Oh, tell, oh, yeah, there we go. Tell a dirty joke. That's what he wants to do? We'll do it. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, and then Ace, oh, he's still feeling tense, but he's talking to Zoya, you know? She's like, yeah, I got out. Your girl got me out. Jenna. Okay, um, here, we're going to, what is this, travel? Go on a vacation? No, we're not going on a vacation. Oh, man, these whims suck. I hate I hate when they do this to me. I hate it. He is not really going to be stopping and hanging out with Steph anytime soon. So who knows when that flirt thing was going to happen, but hopefully it happens eventually. Man, he is really not happy, but neither is this guy. Oh, no. He's feeling really tense, too. He's like, oh, still. People with fires. I know. I know. What is their issue? Okay. Anyway, let me get to the results. Okay. So now everybody's kind of awake. All right. We're going to get, get to the results. So basically, in the comments below on my last part, you guys had the option of voting for any of the eight people. So you had, you could choose Zoya. You could choose Macy. You could choose Raina, Janae, Steph, Landon, Jayun, and Douglas. Wow, that was very, very fast. I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys didn't even see anyone. But it came down to four people getting the majority of the votes, and they were Zoya. This girl right here. So she just came back in, but she did get some votes. Macy right here. Oh, now they're talking. Okay, now. Okay, so. Okay. It, he's inspired now. It's over. It's over. It's over! Okay, and it also came down to Janae. She's like, oh my god, really? Me? I'm like, yeah, girl, you were the first one out of the tub. And also, Jayun. All right? So in the end, the two that got the most votes were Janae and Jayun. so it's perfect that they're in the same shot right now. But one of them is going to be eliminated, and it came down to one vote. One vote, guys. The Sim that is going home and is becoming the second member of the jury is Jayun. She is not happy. Look at this face. She's not happy about this at all. But she is going to join Shelly and be the second member of the jury. And with that, let's move her on out. Jayun has been moved to the sequester house with Shelly and we are down to the final nine. The final nine, guys, what? I can't believe how quickly this game is going. Like, it is insane. We've had 16 sims, but we had, you know, technically 20 if you include the waiting room people. And we are down to the final nine. It's pretty intense and crazy. Who is going to win? I don't know. But guess what? It is time for the next challenge. So for the next challenge, we are actually going to be focusing on each sim and we are going to be doing their selfies so the sims that have the lowest value of selfie will be eligible for elimination so the goal is to have the highest price selfie because if you do you win immunity for the next round boom but the bottom three will be up for elimination so let's start with zoya so zoya has had an interesting journey so far you know she has come from you know being the second is it the second or the third i think it was the third being the third one eliminated to the sequester house and hold on hold on one second guys i can't find her to take a selfie oh there we go so she came from being the third one to go to sequester to, you know, staying strong at the sequester house and making it back into the game. And that's not an easy feat, you know. So what a nice shot of Zoya. Let's get the back. Oh, yeah. See, I feel like that is nicer. You know, a little bit more of the, you know, trees and landscape. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, let's go ahead. We're going to take five selfie shots. Boom. 
Beautiful. How will she do? Oh my freaking god. I'm gonna kill someone. Like, uh, I, I don't even know what to say, Macy. I don't even know what to say. I think it's because I haven't emptied the limb traps. Okay, okay, whatever. Um, Reyna, can you just put this out? Oh my god, now they're- Oh my gosh. Oh my god, they're all- They're all burning each other! Okay. Landon, why don't you put the fire out? Extinguish it. And then all these other people, I can go ahead and have them extinguish themselves. Like, Janae is also on fire. Like, I mean, Reyna, Janae, like- Avery, who does that? Who just comes in and walks into the fire? Like, honestly, what are you guys doing? Has Stephanie also put herself on fire? Oh my god, Stephanie is also on fire. Okay, Stephanie, just... Yeah. I, I hate you all. Like, you all suck. <sighs> oh my god, Stephanie is jumping in now. All right, so that happened. Okay, so I think I know that it's because, yeah. Okay, so can unload and set laundry down? Sure, sure, upgrade. <sighs> All right, Stephanie's, I, I'm just like so over this right now. I hate this laundry room, I hate it. And what is that, ew, okay, hold on, I need Avery. Avery, you need to come and do the laundry. You need to add this to washing machine. That's disgusting. Um, yeah. Oh! Oh my gosh. Avery and Stephanie are officially friends. No oh, way! Yes, okay, St okay, everybody, every... Okay, you know what? You know what? I can't handle everybody going in the chat at the same time, so I'm just gonna do a cheat. We are going to alter needs and fill needs of the world. Okay. That's what we're doing. We're filling needs of the world, okay? So there we go. Thank you for adding that to the washing machine. And now we're going to wash the laundry. Oh, I, that was Zoya. Oh, well, whatever. It's just laundry, okay? It's just the laundry. Okay, moving on to Macy, who started the Dame Fire, who I want to, like, kind of punch right now, but that's okay. Um, all right, so we are going to have you take a selfie, okay? We're going to have you take selfie. Beautiful. Oh, look at Macy. Oh, she's just stunning. Apparently, everyone thinks she's the cutest sim in the game. I don't know. What do you guys think? Okay, so yeah, Macy's had an interesting journey because, like, you know, she's coming in from the waiting room, you know, and she made it in week two with Douglas, and they're still hanging in, man. That's pretty good. So we'll have to see what happens with her. Avery, he now needs to take his selfie. Okay, so take photo as well. Oh, he's going to have his drink in his hand. He's like, I'm a bop. Oops, oops, that was the wrong person, and that's also not a flattering photo, just saying. Oh, what is she? Oh, she's feeling playful. Okay, let's do it. Let's take a selfie. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. He's a goofball. You can see it. You can see it. But Avery, I think, has been, like... He, he started the game off really quiet. No one really noticed him. And then all of a sudden, he's become the love interest of a few Sims. So it's it's interesting to see what will happen with Avery. So yeah, we'll have to play it by ear. Reyna, the queen. Oh my gosh, this girl is totally a queen. Uh, she's won so many things. And she's also been like everyone's fan favorite. So, oh, I was really landed. Trying to sabotage. You know, you know you are. Oh my gosh. Okay, there we go. That's better. That's better. So I feel like this girl definitely could be a front runner, but I'm excited for the fact that the voting will be ending soon because then it's gonna be like t completely random. And look at Douglas and Janae playing ping pong. They are literally becoming BFFs. They're not just becoming friends, they're like becoming best friends. And I think that is so freaking sweet. So um, they just finished up, so it's perfect time to take a selfie. So go ahead, Janae, take your selfie. Oh yeah, she's gonna get landed in the shot. I mean, Douglas, oh, hold on, hold on. All right, let's get Douglas, he's like, Douglas, look at our selfie. <laughs> he's like, dude, I'm really not feeling good. You just beat me at um, the game. So yeah, I hate you right now. Um, he's like, yeah, I lost. What the heck? Okay. <laughs> Steph, Steph, Steph. So again, another person who's come back into the house, you know, and uh, she had quite the social game before. I don't know why she got eliminated. I swear I switched it to Stephanie. What the heck? 
<laughs> okay. There we go. Oh, now she's talking to Ace. You know, she was... I don't know if people voted her out because she was a threat or... But I don't know. I think that Stephanie definitely has a good chance to win. And that is a beautiful photo. That's a beautiful photo, Steph. You looking good. You looking good. Okay, beautiful. All right, and then we have Landon, who's talking to Reyna. These two are thick as thieves, too. Look at their friendship level. They're crazy off the charts. And I love that. I love that these Sims are starting to really form really strong relationships, and they're all forming them on their own. Like, they're not me influencing it. I just like that. I think it's really cool. All right, there we go. He also started the game off pretty much as an underdog. Everyone didn't like him. And then, look, he's done pretty well. I think that he has made a name for himself. He's won a few challenges. And uh, I think people actually do like him now, which is which is pretty cool. Now I was going to go talk to Steph. I saw Steph's trying to get something together. She's trying to figure out if she should go with the noobs or if she should go with the originals. Um, interesting strategy. Okay, so Douglas, 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 Douglas. He has found himself on the bottom quite a few times. The fact that you're still in the game is pretty shocking, my friend. I think you've had a lot of luck. He's had a lot of luck. So we'll have to see how he does. It could be his luck could run out or it could continue. Who knows? But yeah, I do like playing with Douglas. So hopefully his luck continues. Okay, so let's go ahead and play last but not least with Ace. So Ace made the brilliant move to get immunity, but also saved Janae in the last instant elimination. You know, keeping his one of his allies in the game, definitely a smart move. So we'll have to see how it works out for him. But Ace has been very quiet, you know, like I feel like he's a character. He has really beautiful eyes and that sweater really brings him out. He's looking really good in that picture. Okay, so the way this is gonna work. Oh, he's feeling flirty. <gasps> he wants to tell a dirty joke. Okay, can we tell a dirty joke to Janae? I'm really trying, man. I'm trying to play matchmaker. It's hard. It is a lot harder than you think. Trust me. Okay, so let's go. Uh, uh, he can't tell a dirty joke. Seriously? He wants to tell a dirty joke, and he can't tell a dirty joke. Okay, can we do this? What else you got? Oh, nothing. Come on, what else is coming up? He's feeling, he's feeling flirty. There's no other whim that came up. How often does that happen where no whims come up? So look, look, they all come up. He, it's just, it's literally, the, like, it's just a sign that it's not meant to be. It's just a sign. It's just not meant to be. Okay, let's see how much Zoya's photos have sold for. Oh, thank you, Avery. That's awesome. I love it. He did the laundry all by himself. Okay, Zoya sold hers for 40 simoleons. Okay, so right now, that's Zoya in the lead with 40 simoleons. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me replace this. Let me replace it. Don't want it sparking. Crossing another fire. It's the last thing I want. Okay, I think I replaced it now. Is there no more fire hazards, right? Honestly, this laundry was the worst idea I've ever had. In my next LP, I am not putting laundry machines. I'm doing them by hand. That's what's happening. Okay, Macy. So Macy has to beat 40 if she wants immunity. But if she gets less than 40, then she will be at risk of being eliminated. Okay, Macy. All right, herself for 29 simoleons. So that means that Macy has not won immunity, and she's at risk of being in the bottom three. All right, Avery is next. Right on the computer as soon as I replace it, Avery. I see how it is. I see how it is. Okay, Avery has sold his for 48. So technically, Avery is in the lead to win immunity again. That would be back-to-back -back immunity challenges. Okay, Reyna. Reyna needs to beat 48 to stay safe. But technically, the bottom three are Zoya, Macy, and Avery and we will have an official bottom three once we have Renee's vote in. Okay, what does she do? 25! That puts Reyna at the bottom. So it is Macy, Reyna, and Zoya that are currently in last place. Avery is currently the front runner for immunity. Janae, what is Janae doing? Okay, wait, oh, okay, there we go. Janae has sold hers for 40. So that means her and Zoya are tied. So technically it's a bottom four, but if we have to have a tiebreaker, we will. We'll have a tiebreaker, okay? Stephanie looking for that immunity and staying safe. So she just needs to score more than 40 in order for herself to solidify safety. And if she wants immunity, more than 48. Stephanie. 
46, so close. So that means that Stephanie is definitely out of the bottom three, but she has not solidified immunity. Landon is now. <gasps> They're talking. Oh, trip needs so. Does he want to? I don't know how to do that. I don't know how to do that whim, but I shouldn't do it because like they're not immune yet. Okay. All right. Whatever. Anyone that has safety, I'm going to be able to use in the next part. I'm just saying. Okay. Anyone with safety, I'm going to use in the next part. Um, but yeah, that's so cute that they're talking. I love it. I love it. Look at them. They're having fun. Okay. Landon. <gasps> Nine. Okay, so that means that Landon is officially oh, in last. Cool. Reyna is in second last. And Macy is in third last. Which means that Zoya and Janae have just solidified safety for themselves. So it's between Macy, Reyna, and Landon. Douglas. Douglas needs to beat 29 to stay out of the bottom. And he needs to beat 48 to win immunity. What is he going to have? 28. <gasps> That means that Douglas is in the bottom three. Okay, so it's Douglas, it is Reyna, and it is Landon. Okay, A Ace is the next one. Ace needs to beat 28 to solidify a spot as safe. Let's do it. 30! Oh, that was so close, guys. So it is between Reyna, it is between Douglas, and it is between Landon. One of these Sims will be eliminated, and it is up to you to vote now. It's time to vote and find out who will go. Who will it be? I don't know. No one knows. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, in my opinion, that bottom three could not go any worse. It literally could not have gone any worse. Those are three of my favorite players. And on top of that, there's a boy-girl ratio that's out of line. I wanted more boys to stay in. So the fact that two of the boys are in the bottom three and then the other girl, the only alternative to keep the boys is Reyna. It's not exactly my favorite, I'll be honest. Who the heck is this? Do you wish you looked as happy as I do? Well, you have the power. Just send one simoleon to me. Don't delay, happiness is just a simoleon away? Um, excuse me? This sounds like a fraud. This sounds like fraud to me. It's like, no. Um, should we do it? I don't know. Should we do it? You know what? I feel like we should do it. It's only one simoleon. <laughs> Thank you for your contribution. Do you feel happier yet? Oh, wow. That was a total waste. That was a total waste. Hold on. Happy Sim. Giving one simoleon. Oh, okay. There we go. There we go. So she gave a simoleon and she feels a little happier. Wow. That seems like a little fishy, though. I think that's fraud, man. That's that's totally fraud. Can't believe I had to donate a simoleon for that. But yeah, man, it is a tough decision. There's three really good Sims. Um, I really wonder what's going to happen. Are people going to make the power move and maybe get rid of Reyna or even Landon? Because both of them are pretty, really, like, they're both pretty good threats. Or maybe take out the less obvious threat of D uh, Douglas because he hasn't won many challenges. You know, he isn't that strong. So he might have a harder chance of winning at the end. You know, but uh, let's take a look at their social game. You know, yeah, like I, I definitely think that Douglas has has doesn't have as many. Oh wait, that's Reyna. So yeah, she only has really that one friend. Landon has Douglas, Reyna. Uh, yeah, so he has like two, maybe Ace a little bit, and then Douglas has not that many. Landon and Janae, and that's basically it. So yeah. Who do you guys think is going to get voted out? Let me know in the comments below who you want it to be. And I will see you guys in the next part. Bye for now.